built every letter of alphabet lore out of Lego. I only have a budget of $500, so I better be careful how I spend it, because Lego's expensive. First up is A. I got this astronaut set with a rover. I built the set using rover parts and gave it wheels too. This set doesn't have any eye parts, so I got this Lego dot set that has a lot of flat white tiles. I used a sharpie to add a black dot to all the pieces, so I can give all of the letters eyes. Next up is B. I got this boat set that comes with some sort of app. There's no instruction book. Back in my day, Lego came with instruction books, not a story. Wait, it was $40? Damn, Lego's expensive. For C, I got this flying mech set. It says on the website it's called a cyber drone, and that starts with a C. I have to keep the budget low, so some of these sets are a bit of a stretch. This dinosaur set is perfect for D, since it's actually green and it comes with some teeth pieces. This makes D really easy to build. Huh, that's actually decent. Boo. We'll need a set with an elephant for E. I got this Duplo set. Yeah, I know it's not real Lego, but it has the Lego symbol on the box, so it counts. For F, I got this Fast and Furious car set, and it comes with Vin Diesel, and everyone know he stands for family. Also, since the car is black, it's actually really easy to build an F out of it. It's too bad Vin Diesel isn't Chris Pratt, though. Since the Mario movie starring our favorite actor, Chris Pratt, is coming out soon, there's a bunch of Mario Lego sets available. I got this one from Luigi's Mansion because it has ghosts in it for G, and I'll use the purple pieces from the other ghosts to build G. Wait, where's Luigi? This set doesn't come with Luigi. No! Harry Potter starts with a H, so I grabbed a Harry Potter set. It doesn't actually come with many green pieces, so H looks like a tree now. I stands for ice cream, and more specifically, an ice cream truck. This set comes with a blue block with a face on it, so I used that for I. I has never looked more cool. J will be from Jurassic Park, starring our favorite actor, Chris Pratt. I'll build J out of these arch pieces, since the dinosaur is not really a J shape. What even is in a trocoraptor? Did they make that up? For K, I got a set containing a kitchen, this friend's pizzeria. It makes a good K. I could use any Lego for L, since it's all Lego, and that starts with L. But I got this lion set and built L out of that. Any Minecraft set will do for M, but this mushroom one has the right color blocks, so I used it. There's no Lego in my shop that starts with N. Just kidding. This set uh, is in the middle of nature. That counts, and you can't convince me otherwise. O stands for ocean, so I got this set containing a dolphin and a turtle. The turtle looks a lot like the one from Finding Nemo. Looks like Lego has a copyright lawsuit incoming. I used the dolphin parts to build O, and I used the turtle to build a hat for him to wear. I like hats. For P, I got this pony set and used the pink parts to build P. This one actually turned out pretty good. Harley Quinn has a Q in her last name, so I got this set with her and Batman. I'm Batman. <coughs> <laughs> anyway, I built Q using the pieces. It's a kid set, so it doesn't have very many. This robot set makes a good R. Not much else to it. It's the right color. That's nice. S is for Star Wars, but Lego Star Wars is so expensive, so I got the smallest possible Star Wars set, containing the Mandalorian and a mini Razor Crest. And it still somehow costs $17. It has one minifigure. I already built this poor set last week, so I smashed it to make a T out of instead. I'll use this buggy to make you. Why? Because you wish you had a ride as sick as this one. <laughs> I'ma be real. I'm running out of ideas ideas at this point. V can be built out of a vintage car. This James Bond one looks pretty good. That doesn't look too bad. For W, I use this owl set. Owl has a W in it, and this was the only purple set that could make a good W, so deal with it. X is a ninja, so I got a Ninjago set. This was the only one at the store, so I had to make X blue. I'm over my budget, but I must complete all the letters. For Y, I got this Yas, which turns into a Y very easily. It's also way bigger than any other letter, but I'm sure that's fine. The budget won't stretch anymore for Z, so I'm reusing the Jurassic Park set, because that's like a zoo. <laughs> so I used the dinosaur to make Z. Plus, it lets us use Chris Pratt again, our favorite actor. There, all 26 letters of alphabet lore created out of Lego. I'm only gonna be slightly bankrupt. Yay! Okay, thanks, like and subscribe. The alphabet lore plush video is coming soon. Thanks to all my members. Become a member to support the channel and get me out of bankruptcy. <laughs>